All right, let's do this thing and get it over with. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? It is I, Robert Kendra Carter. I just made myself get up out of the sleeper to do this video. How y'all doing out there? Hope all is well. I hope the lighting is good because um, this is the only way you're going to be able to see me. As I rub on my face and rub on my um, chin and all of that other kind of stuff. How y'all doing? Thank you for coming and watching my little channel. Uh, shout out to all of my subscribers that are out there. I, I got a new subscriber yesterday. Tony Vlog. Something like that. Yeah, I gotta do better with these things. To my homeboy, Trucker Forte, who dared me that I could not get his name correct, and I did not do any research. This is based off of my own uh, phonics. I think that you pronounce your name Tuan Pai. Tuan P or Tuan Pai? Yeah. Let me know if I got it right. Um, I am on, man. I'm on. I don't even have my glasses on. And I do not have any um, contacts. So, y'all can see me, but I can't see y'all. And that's literally... And even if you was in my presence, I wouldn't have been able to see you. So, what's been going on? This is day number four. Day number four of our video challenge. <clears throat> and today, I'm going to just talk a little bit about um, my issue with, with transparency. First and foremost, let me let you know where I'm at. I am in Alexandria, Louisiana. Um, and I have to deliver at a store at eight o'clock in the morning. And that store is located Point, Louisiana. So if you're watching and you know anything about those places, that's where I'm at. I'm at a little side, uh, I would say my and pop, but it's probably not my and pop. I don't know. It's just not Love's or Pilot. It's another one, right? Um, and so that's where we are. And that's where I'm broadcasting to you from on tonight. Um, so I'm going to talk about transparency. Um, my understanding of transparency is that visual of being able to see through, see clearly. Um, I think the first time I ever heard of transparent was in elementary school when my teacher you know used to put stuff on the board uh, that they would shine a light on the screen or on the blackboard and she would literally write on the actual overhead projector but for those sometimes like the school kits the education kits would have like transparencies, which were like these sheets that already had been printed for us to look at and study as a class. I didn't understand it uh, philosophically until later, the transparency uh, when it comes to um, life, 
it is being able to be in a public, uh, it could be public or private, but to be, be uh, elevated to a place that those who encounter your presence, encounter your life, you allow them through a great vulnerability to 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 see who you really are or to see what's really going on and so for me that is something that I've been working on for a while now is going through every sphere of life and I don't know why I had to choose that word but going through every uh, uh, situation meeting every person every every encounter I try to be as transparent as I possibly can uh, because we talked about depression uh, a couple of days ago I feel like transparency can alleviate depression so in this challenge to uh, become a a YouTube extraordinaire I don't even know if I'll make it to that but but to get on YouTube um, and allow you to see my life as I take this and show y'all my little bed. And ain't much here, y'all. This is this is how the side of my uh I got my huggies over there. And it's just me, my little belly and everything. You know I guess it can help. Um it can help uh people who who may be struggling likewise or not necessarily struggling joys and joys and happiness <laughs> can also uh, be contagious amongst people but transparency is that which uh, is a portal um, of, of commonality and familiarity and it, it just makes me feel good, I know, when there is someone on a public um, platform that is going through something, has gone through something, experienced something, reads, sees something in the same way in which I do. So, even now as I am in front of this camera talking to you, I felt the weight go off. It took me a while. I wasn't even going to do a video today. I wasn't going to do a video today. I drove. I'm tired. I'm sitting here and I'm looking at other trucks in this parking lot. And things are going on. Life is going on. I did not want to get on this camera tonight. But that's a part of the challenge to be as transparent as I possibly can. Even now as I think about, you know, when you get out here uh, and I'm gonna go there, I know I'm gonna go here, but I'm being transparent, the sexual self, you know, we be ready to park this truck, get something to eat, get in the back. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I said that, I can't believe I did it and jack off and if you a female you might not jack off but whatever females do you know and I feel some kind of way bringing it up but it's real and so right now I'm being transparent I'm letting y'all see that's all I wanted to do today so I can get up in the morning uh so that was the challenge of the day to literally I 
hate the fact that I say literally so much. That's another thing. Um, but to, I'm gonna change it up to actually, <laughs> to actually just shut down and go to sleep. That's all I want to do. But I must complete the work. And I feel a little bad too, y'all. I don't know why. I had Sonic today. I gotta eat better. Fiji. <laughs> I don't even know. This 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 water is supposed to be coming from the islands of Fiji or some shit like that. Half the time we don't know what we're drinking. They might have Corona in this water. COVID-19. But because my stomach is hurting a little bit. Um, Trucker Forte, I hope I got you right. Twan pie. <laughs> That's what it's, uh, it looked like. I, I, I tried every, I mean, I probably called you everything but a child of God. But I think it's Twan pie. Uh, anybody else that's watching this, hey, how y'all doing? I am Robert Kendra Carter, and this is the African Trucking Channel, or the African Channel, because it's not really a trucking channel, but I just so happen to be a trucker now. I've been on this mission for about a year. I have water on my lips. And, um, you are watching a 24 day challenge where I get on here regardless of how I feel and at least talk and right now it's been 12 minutes and if you're still watching God bless your soul God bless your soul yeah I'm being narcissistic right now I'm looking at myself in the camera okay so I think my work here is done I hope that I heard her, her. Uh, he, oh, oh. I hope that uh, my little tidbit about transparency um, touches somebody. Um, you don't have to always be, but I feel like transparency is the key to free spiritedness. Uh, the only thing I've never done is gone. I've never been at a new beach, and I don't know if I could ever be that open. Go to a new beach. But then that ties into loving yourself. So maybe we'll talk about that tomorrow. Maybe we'll talk about what it is to love yourself. Right now I really feel like a real dweeb that has nothing. I feel like I'm a depressed mess. Um, Yeah, yeah, that's pretty good. Let's talk about that. We're going to talk about loving yourself because I'm still having to learn how to love everything that's on my body, the way I talk, the way I'm presented. I worry about how people perceive me a lot. Um, and probably a lot more than I knew. I'm thinking about it right now. We're doing it. <laughs> I'll be back.